I can't buy an order of the white feather. <laughs> what the hell am I about now? It matters not. Um, what does matter though is I just realised my pool dof dolphins have disappeared. I've got my pool seals. Where are the fucking pool dolphins from? Pool is a pottery. Pool pottery. I think they're pool. I was calling pool anyway. Are two pool dolphins. Where the fuck are they? What reminded me of that? Partly, I just went to Tesco's and all goes, do you ever lose your glasses? And it's like, well, yeah, I do all the time. These ones are on my head, though. And yesterday, um, I found some in my pocket that I've been going on about for ages and the house brownies, which is like a fairy. But also, this, I didn't tell you, after ringing that big old bell and saying brownies don't revolve around bells, because normally you can call, so they go to this thing, it's ring a bell, and, and they have to tell you where it is. Um... I found the other pair on the sink in the bathroom. Like, okay, so they're turning up again. Um, what else turned up yesterday after something else turned up? What the fuck are my pool dolphins though? You can't see the words for the trees. You can't spell you out on your knee. Wow. Um, I saw so many good things in the shops that I really wanted to get, but. Let's just talk you through what I did get because I had mm, ten pounds that I owe my son, but I had to use it for food because I had things paying back on Thursday rather than borrowing any more money off him. So that's what I got. I don't know what to get for the dog, so I don't know what I'm back in the same space. I kicked a stone, I bought stones, what's that? Um and I bought bones. Mm. And then so I decided to get this. Chicken, this is one ninety nine, chicken legs bone from it so she can have one of those and I thought well, I can use the other one to make some soup as well but I've got carrots if you want to and some broccoli a piece of broccoli and one potato which I put a label on I tried to print it thing and then put a label on it which because I wanted them much was going to roughly cost 23 pence so that's making soup I got peas for the noodle diet I'm on a noodle diet a noodle fast actually. So I've got garden peas for eight pence. One of those for a pound. One of those. This is what I was just going to feed the dog to start with. I can make it like chicken porridge, can't I? And I've got a bit of pasta as well. But she's had nothing but literally porridge for ages, so she's probably keying yeah. over. And then I've got the, the knockout lee noodles. 20 feet a pack. This is what I was just going to get to start with. I've got six of those. Uh, I just really fancied noodles before I went out. I really fancied noodles, you know. So I've got six packets of the devil's own, the devil's own biscuits. It's true. Noodles and peas is what I'm going to have next. And then I ate a whole packet of donuts. The man doing a scratch card outside the shop. I had to go and sit down after the first round of Sainsbury's and eat the donuts. Well, I thought about what to get next. And that's when I kicked the pebble afterwards and decided to get the chicken. Um, doing a scratch card, I said, would you like a donut? He goes, no, thank you, my darling. And I said, oh, I just thought because, and I said, don't, you don't take sweets from strangers, do you? Your mother brought you up properly. Um, I just thought because you're doing a scratch card, this might be the prize. Um, and then I had the whole packet. So, lucky for me, cheese, flavour, tortilla chips. They are pounds from Tesco, and they're vegan, which is weird stretch at the moment because I'm not really eating anything that's vegan. But first of all I did take, you know what, the whole devil's chalice going on, I found this. And it was 75p, but I think it's like it's quite nice. It's quite nice. <laughs> For passing around. That's not actually true. I just liked it. And plus with the red spring coming up, I always call it the red red and well white well at Glastonbury. Which ones did we drink from on the road? Um, so the red spring comes through the wall on one side and that's the one that I'm fairly certain I took from first and the opposite side where the doorway is was like the pool which I think was on that other picture but there used to be a tree there I'm not sure if it's there anymore but there's just like a ribbon on, on a thing on YouTube with a purple ribbon tied to it there used to be a tree there I'm almost 100% certain which we tied my door to by her left leg there's truth is that chalk on that side? The white wells through chalk and the red wall i thought it was like peat but it's iron isn't it commemoration commemoration cup 
So how many loops? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, I can't count them. Yeah, eight lips of pans, sharing cups. I love this so much. What could do with it? It looked nice with sweet peas, though, wasn't it? Red and white. <sighs> Not sweet peas, what are they called? Snowdrops. Snowflakes, I don't know. <laughs> Snowflakes, all right. Sister preacher. I was thinking that all around how it's stuck in my head. It just cheers other people up. <laughs> it's true. Granny's gone off the bat. She's gone off the wall. I don't know what to do with it now. It's quite a nice. How much does it weigh? Should we weigh it? Why didn't I get those other ones with a gold print on it, like my other things? Because the ones I've got hand painted are the ones in the shop. Those um, goblin glasses are printed. It's not the same. I looked at them. I looked at them again today. I'll tell you what I did like as well. In uh, RSPCA, that little cat teapot I had old. I don't know which one's which. I can't remember which one. The, I don't know. The one. <laughs> Bunny's always talking in my ear. And he said, oh, I liked. He likes a cat too. You know, I was talking about different things in the shop because, yeah, and some people like, why would somebody. What am I supposed to do with this? It's like a pot. Like, because people give him things all the time. Um, and then we laughed about the cat teapot because yeah, see, I always loved a bit of like something like, like a cat teapot. It's funny; it makes it just makes me giggle. I like the cat teapot as well, and the horse glasses. That's what drives me in the shop today. Dolphin's gone. Christ's sake. <laughs> They'll turn up. They better fucking turn up here. Ring the bell again. Then the can. Then the can. What can? Oh, the storage can. Well, fucking gonna have them back then, please. And all my other stuff. Where are they? Where have There they are. They were in the can. They were hiding under the fern. <laughs> They're under the fern. <laughs> They're under the fern. Thanks, Warren. Warren, 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 Warren,
I thought afterwards because of the bell jar thing. I should have just stuck it onto a jar and see if I got to send it back again. Um, I think when I said from a laboratory, maybe they're just testing things back and forth again. So if you put it under a bell jar, it works in the same way for me. It's going to be covered with something, maybe? I don't know. You just put a cup over it. You have a spider sometimes. You put a cup over it. You send it off somewhere else. And What, have I got a bell jar? Well, not an actual bell jar. I've got this one with a little blue dragon in it. That my friend made. Who's this for? Well, this was going to be for my grandson, Nixie, Phoenix. I didn't give it to him because I thought it would get smashed. I just ended up keeping it here um, as a memory, I suppose. I just liked it. It was a dragon under a, under a Belgian or a cheese thing. <laughs> it's just funny. I thought it was cute. I need to clean it though. I, want, I don't want the star to fall off when I scrub it with a toothbrush. I'll do that in a minute. I read the bell jar, yes. But weren't they used for um snuffing butterflies? That for butterfly collectors. Bit of chloroform. I think that's all I have to say really. That will never be all of them. I'll tell you what though, I showed you this before, I'll show you again in case you can't be off to go for all my stuff. And I might have deleted it before it got uploaded anyway. My pants palace. I've kept pants palace as you know. natural pan's chalice probably from the order of the golden dawn and it's got like um a little dip on it so you know where you're passing around and you'll have to drink from it because there's one two three four five six lips and there's washing as well i think it's fucking washing The order of the golden dawn. It's true. You can't say it's not true. That's from the Anvil Centre. <laughs> Yeovil. Anvil, mate. That's the Anvil Cup. For... I'm just telling a story. It's a, a senseless one. Dolly wants a piece of this chicken. She's looking at me. She eats chicken legs. Oh, I remember I was in town that day with that girl. We well, was just sitting out on the bench drinking a coffee and I said I was just like oofling some bloke. Well window shopping I suppose. I don't really like him, he's got legs like a chicken. I thought that's a rude thing to say for a starter. Chicken's like a running away person, isn't it? Dogs make me laugh when they do that. If you give them something they don't recognise, that's a sleuthy thing. They just look at it and poke it with their nose. All right, get off the oats, mate. The old stoats. The brambly stoats. Look, do you want this bit of chicken? Now she's going to try and eat it.
must be hungry. She's not cashing it. Not cashing it. Then. Cashing means storing. If dogs cash food, it means they're burying it under a pillow or something. Same use of that with fish. I don't know one more thing I just want to do since we're together. Let's go and see if those bulbs are coming up. I don't know if I've got enough gas on my phone. All this here. Let's take a run. Let's take a run through the jungle. And I don't want you. A ski jacket on there. That made me laugh on that hacker thing the other day about they found the ski jacket. <laughs> in old Kevin's. In old Kevin's. Wardrobe is what um, there's the fish that and the ponds of, equ of equality. My coik, I have a shit down here. Secret, and I don't want you. Oh, it's a leaf, that's okay. And I don't mean you. It's a shadow ship. Sister Bridget. That one's risen to the surface. There's green spikes. And some more. No flowers on them yet, though. Ah, oh, what's this? What's this showing? I don't know what that is. I don't know what's not showing there. It is a valley. I feel some bit of a valley in here. I found some dragon buskets have disappeared. Oh, maybe it's there. I went and see. That looks a bit like old Michael Mastasis, but I'm not sure. I don't think it is, I'm not certain. <laughs> and somebody left this rosemary from remembrance on my doorstep. I don't know who it was there. Rosemary from remembrance. But that's also rosemary grinds. But remembrance grinds. <laughs> Can you stop it, says please? Can you stop it? I've got enough problems without you, uh, old blanket woman, singing my songs. What am I going to do about? I don't know what I'm going to do about the uh, about the um, the landlord thing. I need to drag out like an old. What am I drag? Hey, the lilac's trying to grow. Um, an old. What's it called? Contract. Maybe the last one I signed to see how much I should be paying. I can find one anyway. I'm sure the ones they've had, they scribbled over with Byron and changed all things. <laughs> and then I can just try and sort out that money. Because if I go to the council, they're going to want to know something, aren't they? I can't just go to the council so they can sort this out. The problem is, though, when they cleared my house, they took a load of my stuff, so I don't know what I've got even. Oh, so it's not going to worry like that. I left it all in the cold under all that shit of Dexter's. Dexter stuff wasn't there at the time. I might need some of these folders. Let's have a look. My grandfather told us you're not supposed to throw papers away for at least 10 years. Um, could be bank statements. Uh. Da -da 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 -da. 
I cried already. Just like a piece of chicken. That's enough to keep you going for weeks. Let's see. Let's have a try to the food. Just the conference. Okay, it'd be too easy, would it? Keep it together. What's that for now? Oh, unfortunately, only one of my personalities was any good at filing. Uh, this is the bank one. Oh, hang on. I've even put some cash things in it. What are they called? It's British. Doctor, Council, which is Trust, Anglia Warwick. This. And pension. It's nothing in it. <laughs> uh, Norfolk NHS Trust. What's this? We'd like to offer you a fine point of mission for men, community mental health nurse. On. NHS Trust. ESA. Set of your information. How your employment and support allowances have worked out. You're living expenses, extra money because you're severely disabled, extra money because of disability income guarantee, limited capacity for work addition, extra money because your support group, which could be total income related, income for benefits, PIP, other income for your household, your total income, your income related amount is this minus this. Your income related entitlement is Hayley Allen Manager. Uh, well, I was disabled then. Can you be undisabled? What do you think of this decision at all? Well, I'm not really in a position to judge if I'm disabled or not, surely. Ask us for an explanation of the decision or to explain why I'm disabled. Uh, I don't understand what that says. I'm disabled on that page and I'm disabled with that bit of reading. And I'm disabled to find what I'm disabled. With. Forward Intelligence Bureau, new. Nope. I don't think it's in here. I've been saved by Browning. It's true. Oh, hang on, this might be a bit. Schedule of payments required. Uh, City Council willing to pay. Unfortunately, the overpayment and claim will be completed. Unfortunately, the overpayment may have been claimed informally. It will be completed by the end of April. Not to the council. £120 every four weeks. Rent due is £750 a month, i.e. 692.4. Oh, 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 oh. every four weeks. Amount due from tenants, £270 every four weeks. Amount due from tenant, £212.22 from 1st of May 2019. I don't know what I'm paying then. Rent due every four weeks. From 1st of May 2019, rent due every four weeks. £692.30. Council pay. Four hundred eighty pounds and eight pence. The amount due from tenant two hundred twelve pounds twenty two. I know I want you, but I don't need you. It's all relative to the state of the teacher. I go back to bed now. All roll over. Advice from. Where am I going to put that? Where am I going to put it? Just 
I don't know how to do that. I need to find a bank statement to see how much I'm paying. I've already forgotten how much I'm supposed to be paying. And I feel so low. 